Hey guys, this is Gloria. Welcome back to my channel. I wanted to share with you guys um, another Bible journaling entry, but first I want to share all of the products that I use to create my entry. Um, the first thing that I used was this Amy Tangerine um, roller date stamp, and I like this one because it has the word created on there, so I like to use that one whenever I'm creating in my um, Bible. I also use this Gamsaw, which is a orderless um, mineral spirit and this is used for blending color pencils and this was $4.99 at Hobby Lobby. I got this a while ago and so um, I'm sure they still carry it or you can find it at Michael's or Joanne. I also use some washi tape out of my stash, really pretty gold. Um, this one has different words on it and then this one is like a black with a pattern on it. I also use this particular stamp and I love this girl's stamp. Um, I can't really remember right now where I got this from um, but if I do remember I will link it down below or if I can find the name of the um, the place that I actually picked that up from. I use this Memento uh, ink and this one is in tuxedo black. I also use a stamp block. Um, I use this bright and brave um, paper pieces from um, Illustrated Faith and um, this was a day spring product and I picked that up either from Dayspring or from a store that is no longer in business, which was um, Family. I think it was called Family Christian Bookstore or something like that. Um, I also used some of the stickers that I picked up from Michaels. And I used some of the word stickers as well as the um, little heart in the second one. Um, I also used a blending stump. These I got from Hobby Lobby. They come in different sizes, but I really like using this um, wider one here. And I also used my Jane Davenport um, Magic Wand pencils. And this, these are the colors that they come in. Really pretty, vibrant colors. And so um, I use these, but you can definitely use um, even down to the Crayola brand um, color pencils because they work well, especially when you're blending inside of your Bible because of the way the Bible pages are made. And also... Um, when you're using the Gamsol because the Gamsol just blends everything perfectly. So let me share with you guys um, what I created on this week. And this is Genesis and the verse is, um, it's second, um, it's Genesis 2 and it is 22 through 25. And I'll just read what it says. It says, then the Lord God made a woman from the rib he had taken out of the man and he brought her to the man, and the man said, This is now bone of my bones and flesh of my flesh. She shall be called woman, for she has taken out, I'm sorry, for she was taken out of man. That is why a man leaves his father and mother and is united to his wife, and they become one flesh. Adam and his wife were both naked, and they felt no shame. And so I wanted to actually journal on just the creation of woman or women and so what i did was i used the washi tape up top um, this is the pretty black washi tape here and then i used some glitter washi tape that was actually cut with a scallop die and then i used this pretty um uh teal kind of color washi tape up top and it has like um crosses on it really really cute and then this is that little bit that I used out of that pack that just says love. And this woman, um, these stickers right here, they were actually colored with like a floral pattern. But I just took my marker and I um, colored all on them black so that that can kind of stand out. Um, I used those stickers here where it says adorable, amazing, sweet, lovely, pretty, beautiful. And then I used another stamp and I forgot to pull that stamp, but it says handmade. And it had those four hearts and I put just for you. And because um, this kind of represents what the scripture was talking about, that woman was handmade for man and it was just for him. Um, I put some of these little puffy hearts on there and I forgot to pull those as well. And then this, I absolutely love. This is that stamp that I stamped out and I did color her in with my color pencils and then blended out everything with my Gamsaw and I think it came out really, really cute. Had a lot of fun coloring this up. Um, this is a sticker out of that pack from Michaels that says beautiful day and I just took my pen and I just kind of traced around it. And then at the bottom here, um, I cut out the word beautiful out of that washi tape 
and I just stuck that down there and then these are the other washi tapes that I use and then this is a bow that my friend Kendra gave to me in a last in one of my last happy mail stashes that she gave to me and I just think that it came out super cute now this background back here this behind here this is all color pencil and it looks like almost like um, either watercolor or it looks like um, uh, a marker but the Gamsol actually blends out things so well that you don't really see the pencil marks in it all you see is just a blended color and then I also want to share with you guys the back of the page and as you can see with using the color pencils and the Gamsol you don't get any of the color bleeding through to the other side and I actually love that technique more than any other technique that I've ever used in my Bible. Now you will see um, the stamped image um, show through and that's because I use the Memento um, Tuxedo Black ink and I'm not sure if there's any other inks that um, will not bleed through your page because these pages are super thin but I just love 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 the way this page came out and I hope that you guys do too. Um, I also use a tab up top where I actually stamp the date out and that is going to act as my little tab as well as the date um, to remember when I actually did this page. So that is about it, guys. I hope that you guys like my page just as much as I do. If you guys have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. And I'll get back with you as soon as I possibly can. Take care, guys. Bye.